Hello, everyone. Today, we are going to make a status effect system, similar to Minecraft effects system. We will start with the UI. We will start with a frame on the side. Make sure the size are scale for better performance. The Y-axis size won't matter since it will be auto sized. Set on a size to Y. The most important part is this. Set the Y anchor point to the same as the position of Y. Align them again if you need to. Time to make the actual effects you want. Follow my steps. Create a UI list layout. You can design the other stuff however you like. Here is an example of how it would look like. Let's increase the padding. I prefer offset. Now we need to add the text labels. Name them effect num and effect duration. Now design them however you like. Now we need a specific plugin. The link will be in the description. Select all three objects. Once the menu appears, follow the instructions. And this will show up. Save it for later. Make a module script. Name it anything. This function will turn numbers to Romanian numbers. This will be the main part.
That is the important stuff. Time to work on the effects. We will start with speed. The task spawn will be for the timer. That is it for speed. Time to test. I already have it set up. It works. However, it gives it to me without checking if I already have it. We'll fix it soon. We'll do regeneration now. Just copy and paste from the previous effect speed. The reason I did the task spawn functions is so the regeneration doesn't mess up with the effect duration. For bleeding effect, we will copy and paste regeneration. We'll do slight changes. Replace math.min with math.max. Replace the max health of the humanoid to zero. And make it subtract one instead of adding one. Time to test. Regeneration works. Okay, time to add the UI. We will now use the old UI script we say. We'll make a function for it. You don't need to rename them. Just do as I say. We first need to return them.
the duration labeled that text has to be the duration. Do not forget the font. Now we actually need to use the function. So follow my steps. Is it for the UI? Time to test. There is a bug, but do not worry. We will fix it soon. This part is the easiest. Create a function and follow my steps once again. I will explain this part at the end of the clip. Is it? Time to test. It works. I changed the parts codes to explain the part one showed earlier. Basically, you will get the effect if you already have it. Expect if the one you already had has lower level than the new one. Here are the effects for the model I made in the description. We will start with speed. Then jump boost. However, it only works when the CHARACTRUSGUMPPOWER is enabled. Slowness is speed but reversed.
Invisibility will make your body transparent. Level 1 being 0.1-ing. Level 10 being 1. For last, we have poison. It is the same as bleeding, but deals to horsepower every one level seconds. However, it has the same Minecraft potion mechanic, which will stop dealing damage at one horsepower. 